Oh, what is this? It's my brother's body. Looks like he was stabbed to death. It's the Father Story DLC. So we're going to continue now. Last we left off, Amelia, who was sick in bed. We passed out from exhaustion from being awake for three days. And now Amelia is gone. I really should have just paused this. Uh, now Amelia is gone when we woke up. And we have to find her. Now, uh, it's assuming that the brother came and took her because the brother... Uh, the brother's been one to kind of try to say, listen, if we have her, then we can get out of this uh, war zone. But I know Adam, the father, he doesn't want to let him go because, frankly, he doesn't want to carry his daughter through an actual war zone. Uh, no signs of struggle. She knew the person who took her. Oh, see? See? It's the fucking brother. I'm pretty sure it's the fucking brother. He, unfortunately, is very hungry, depressed, and tired. Now, I honestly shouldn't have built that. Uh, I should have saved that wood and components to be able to go to the other... Um, to the other building. Footprints of a grown man. My brother really did this. I need to pay him a visit. Oh. Oh, it looks like we're actually going to be paying people a visit now. Through a war zone. I don't think this is... Oh, the night. Okay. I was going to say I'm like, I don't think this is a good idea. Brother's house. Uh, what do, what do I want to take with me? Well, unfortunately, there's not really much I want to take here. Just look for Amelia. Oh, unless I should have taken the wood. Oh, I'm an idiot. Should have taken the fucking wood. Looks abandoned, but I'd rather check thoroughly. Amelia might still be here. Oh, there's somebody in there. Who's in here? Is that a rat? That just may be a rat. All right, let's open it. Yeah, it's a rat. Let's go inside the house. Hello, rat. Anyone home? Brother! Nothing's here. Okay. What's in the fridge? Is there something in the fridge, potentially? So, fist is my only weapon that I have right now. Some food. I'll take the food. What about in here? Uh, okay, more water. I don't understand why there's water in this, but okay. <laughs> uh, oh, Amelia, are you here? I'm running around. I'm making a lot of noise, but unfortunately right now, I really don't care. I, I think this is one place that's a bad... Jesus Christ! So he's gun components. He has fertilizer, some books... This guy has a lot of stuff here that I can I can take for myself. So I'm kind of glad I didn't bring anything with me because if I did, then I wouldn't be able to grab all this stuff. Let's look in this room here. There's no reason to sneak, man. There's no one here. They're not here. Dim. Maybe there are clues whereabouts of the papers. So did they go to the airport? Is that where they went? Because that's the only other place that's been open to me right now is to go to the airport. Okay, so let's grab all that. Let's go over here. A pile of letters, none of none from people I know. Some mentioned the humanitarian corridor. Maybe I'll find something that can lead me to where they took Amelia. Okay, well, what is this then? There's a letter on the floor. We're doing it tonight. The government forces their final listen to the UN are opening the corridor. Road DL1 is supposed to go safe for 24 hours. We can finally get out of this hellhole. You know the meeting place. G. P.S. Please make sure to stop by the pharmacy on the way. We need all the meds and bandages we can get. We have many sick and wounded, including children. Oh. They're headed towards the pharmacy. All right. I should also check the uh, the basement to see what I have down there. I don't think there's anything out here, but we're going to see. There's one place I can search. This guy has like a little ravine in his area. That's kind of very cool. That's kind of very cool is what I just said. That's, that's kind of very cool. Kind of very cool. Not very cool. It's kind of very cool. He's very hungry. He's depressed and he's tired. Unfortunately for myself, I don't have anything that I can... Uh, Lock, this is where my brother stores his gun. He probably has the keys on him. Oh, that sucks. Well, there's actually bars. I need to I need to cut the bars. And yeah, that's probably where all the fucking guns are. Alright, let's get out of here then. So are we doing this now where we're coming back to the actual old place and then we're we're going back out again and kinda of going back and forth, back and forth? That's just fine. I got a problem with that. Day five. Okay, so I am back in my house now. Uh, the night was calm. Oh, I'm thankful about that. All right, let's, uh, uh, okay, let's go, let's go, let's do this. Let's see if we can make a makeshift bridge for the time being. So it is 6.20 a.m. I can sleep if I wanted to. Uh, makeshift bridge, I still need components. Oh, my lordy. Though I can do a crude stove so I can actually start making some, uh, some food for myself. Some wood, some components, a lot of, it's gonna use a lot of components, holy crap, but let's make that because frankly that is something I do need. That way I can make, I think I can make something with the, the meat that I have, like a, like a meat soup or something. As delicious as that sounds. My brother must have taken Amelia and is planning an escape with her via the humanitarian, humanitarian corridor. He'll visit this pharmacy and take what he can before he goes to the rally point. I must catch them at the pharmacy. Well first, you're gonna build a cooker and you're gonna eat. What will it... What good will it do? I wish I had... 
Every time, everything points in the pharmacy, I need to check it out. Don't do... You need... Okay, first and foremost, you're hungry. You need to be able to get fed. You're very tired. You should te technically take a nap. Just saying. Just saying. Okay, so what can we make here? Uh, I need fuel. So, I do have... So, I have a book. It'll give me one fuel. But I need two fuel. So, let's do this. We're gonna do... We're gonna make some fuel. We're gonna make one meal. Which will kind of get rid of our very hungry... And then from there, we'll see if we can take a little bit of a nap to get rid of the tiredness. I know we got to get to the pharmacy, unfortunately, but at this point in time, I'm, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to, like, go crazy to try to get to there. So let's make this. We'll eat this for ourselves. Take a wee bit of a nap until it gets to the night. Okay, eat, my man. Eat. You need. You need food. Eat it, eat it. Get yourself an egg and beat it. You're still hungry after that? Jesus Christ. I thought that would get rid of the hangar altogether, but apparently not. Is he is he actually sleeping? Is this what's happening? He's actually sleeping? Okay, I, I hope he is. I don't know who could sleep through this, but nonetheless, let's let's end the day. Nothing is like a good sleep. Okay, so the pharmacy is where we want to go. Material, meds, and parts. That's exactly what I want to do. So let's prepare to go there. There's no one there that I, I need to protect anymore, and everything is here, but I'm not going to take anything because I don't need anything like that. So, so the whole concept of this, I, I'm assuming, is you go, you, you start off, and now you're looking for Amelia. My brother's pharmacy. Is Amelia here? Maybe we shouldn't run, dude. Okay, let's go up here. Because it looks like they can't enter that way. Let's go in here and see what's over here. Is anyone inside? I don't see anyone. But this is where we got to be very careful. Because people can now be here. And the only weapon I have is a, is a fist. Okay, we can grab that wood. Is there anyone in here? I don't see anyone as of yet. And I don't hear anyone anywhere. So let's open this up. What is this? Muddy footprints of a grown man. Someone has been here recently, or still is. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, and jumping like that will for sure make them realize that we are still here. Uh, oh, nice. A nice amount, of, nice amount of components. There's no one around that I'm still seeing. There's no sound effects or the sounds I'm, I'm hearing. Okay, so we're going to grab all that. Anything over here? I don't see anyone there, so let's go. It's barred from the other side. Oh, that's fantastic. That's what I want. It's barred from the other side. How nice. Uh, med wrap syringe bandages. Someone was in a hurry despite looking for something. What happened here? Oh, this place has been definitely torn apart. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, the... It's Amelia's toy. She was here. A man's footprints wasn't my brother. Amelia's in danger. I need to follow the trail. All right, yeah, just grab whatever the hell you can, man. Yeah. There's no one in there. Let's go in there. Oh, look. More stuff that we can search. Brother, what happened? Where's Amelia? Oh, what is this? It's my brother's body. Looks like he was stabbed to death. No signs of Amelia. Did someone take her? Where to? I must find out. Oh, my lord. The footprints lead upstairs. There is, There are bloodstains, too. Oh. Oh, this, this is no good. This is no good. Whoever it was, they must have turned around towards the back alley door. Let's break this open, actually. Let's just break this open, make some noise. A little bit of noise is always fine. It's fine, you know, it's, it's, always, it's always fine. This is fine. I'm okay with the events that are unfolding currently. I do want to check up here and see what there is up here. I'm doing this, so if I need to escape, this is a very quick, easy access. Door is unlocked, and there's blood on the door handle. I need to check it out, the back alley. First and foremost, let's go up upstairs. Oh, I'm an idiot. Didn't even look to see if anyone was in here. I just went right in. That's kind of stupid of me. <laughs> Maybe let's not do that. Oh, we got some nice meds. We got some nice meds. The heavy-duty meds. That's what we want. We want the heavy-duty meds. We also want some food. Okay, or water. Water's fine. We'll get the water. Save is busted open. It was clearly robbed. Okay, so now let's go in the back here. Uh, obviously... They escaped through this way. We need to see where the hell they went. Oh, there's another. Is there another building? Looks like just rubble. Hmm. Trail of blood leads down the alley towards the gas station in Amelia's school. The gas station is located by the road that leads out of the city. The soldiers don't let anyone out. But if someone passed as parents or a dying child, who knows? The school is closed now. But I've already, I've heard that some people moved there after the she the shelling. Could one of them be abducting Amelia? Oh no. 
school and gas station. Okay. So we got two places now. We also got some nice uh, herbal meds, which kind of help with uh, if you're just sick. Day six. Teen. All right, let's see what we can do around the house. Night was calm. Nothing was done. Uh, I have meds. I'm, not, I'm tired. I'm depressed. Okay. I found my brother's body in the pharmacy. I can never... Pharmacy, if it was as if it was somebody was looking for something in a hurry, whatever it was, I hope they didn't hurt Amelia. Found my brother's body in the pharmacy. I never thought that death would stay, would shake me so much. Amelia wasn't with him. What? Who could have taken her and where to? I hope she's all right. The trail leads either the gas station or, or the school. But where should I go first? It might be my only chance of finding Amelia. Okay. Um, that is true. So let's actually go up here. And, because, actually, no, hold on. Let's see if we can do the makeshift bridge. Because I did receive a lot of wood and I have a lot of components now. So the bridge... For God's sake. Really? Really? Oh, you suck. Okay, let's go up here and see at least ma about making some weapons. Because if we're starting to go now and there's going to be some bandits involved here and some people who have taken Amelia, we need to be able to protect ourselves. And having something to protect ourselves is very, very important. So the crowbar, I'm going to make one crowbar. Because the crowbar is going to also help us kind of break open some stuff that requires lockpicks. Because not everything always requires lockpick. I can just break it open with a crowbar. That's exactly what we can do. Uh, so we're going to do this. I'm going to try to build another lockpick as well. There's, no, there is a point. Don't complain. Okay, Adam, just build it. I don't have any food, which kind of sucks, unfortunately. But we're going to have to go with what we got. Okay, so we got that built. So let's also let's also build a shovel. We need a shovel. To be honest, I need a shovel. So I have a weapon. I have a shovel. I'm going to bring the shovel just in case I find any more mounds like this and I can break them open. But the bridge is something I still need to get over to this. And from what all I can do right now is unfortunately uh, is take a nap. That's all I can really do right now. So you can see we can now break this with the actual crowbar. So we can actually break a, a majority of these with the crowbar. Lockpick is a one-time use. The crowbar has multiple uses, but eventually breaks down over time and will uh, break. So I'm going to put you to sleep, and then we're going to end the day. Because there's nothing I can do right now, unfortunately. And I'm, I probably don't want to go to the school. I'm probably going to go to the gas station first. Maybe that uh, they'll have some nice stuff there that I can use. Um, so let's see. Where is this brother's house? Which I visited, looted a gas station, some food, some material, huge amounts of weapons in South Parts. The gas station has already been looted, but the trail led to either school or there. Maybe millions of captors are trying to leave the city that way. I can still catch them. And the school, trail of pharmacy leads either to the gas station or there. Maybe it used to be go to that school. I've heard rumors that now it's overrun by the homeless. Maybe they've seen or heard something. I see. Okay. Um, I see this though, huge amount of weapons. I have some weapons right now, but the homeless may be able to help me in case somebody's actually seen them. So let's actually go there. Uh, let's take the crowbar and end that. Uh, they're homeless, though. Maybe just in case I'm going to bring the herbal meds in case they want to kind of barter. I know coffee is also a big thing. Maybe, maybe. Actually, no, keep the coffee here. Let's do it. will take the, the meds because we may want to barter with the homeless in case like you know have you seen their wall if i have something i may tell you if i saw her and i'll be like well here's some meds you motherfucker lots of mud and fresh footprints there must be quite a lot of people living here i never asked around someone must have seen something okay so let's go in here let's look to see if uh there's any homeless here there's no homeless here but they'll probably be around somewhere let's search the area i think i see uh oh look a bullet i think i see a mound there that i can actually dig up is there somebody up there I sense somebody's up there. Oh, just trash. All right, let's look through here. Nope, it's just a rat. That's just a rat that's there. Let's try to break this open and go up. I've seen somebody there, but I think that's a rat. I think that's actually just a rat that's uh, moving around. Causing a stir. You know what I mean? Hey. <laughs> okay, another bullet and components or gears, which is fine by me. Somebody may be there, or this may be the rat again. Hello? Hello, are you going to open the door? No, it's a rat. All right, let's go inside. Let's go downstairs. There's potentially homeless over there. Damn, this is a big-ass building. Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, this was the school, right? So this, the, I'm assuming this would be a big-ass building. Okay, let's go in here. Uh, when will it end? They took my food again. Okay. Uh, I don't know how this guy's going to be. 
Hey, buddy. How you doing? I'm looking for my daughter. Have you seen a little girl around? No, sorry, but ask the others. Maybe they know something. Okay. All right. You're 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 down to earth, obviously. You're not gonna... You're not aggressive, so that's kind of cool. That's always good to know that you're not aggressive. A pile of papers, all rubbish, except for the note that mentions a humanitarian corridor. We need to flee the city somewhere, how, somehow, and soon. I've learned of a humanitarian corridor to be open in a couple of days for the wounded and children to use if we need to either get seriously wounded or some children with us. I'm sure you understand which option I prefer. Oh, okay. Let's go down here, as I thought I saw, there, was, there was something over here. Kidnapping a child is a pass to flee the city. Oh, God. That's pretty much what would happen. They, they kidnapped your kid because they want to leave the city. Oh, who's this? Oh, this guy looks, uh, interesting. Hey, buddy. How you doing over there? Oh, there looks like plants and herbs in there, but I can't get there. Because I don't have a saw. I'm looking for my missing daughter, a little blonde girl. Oh, yeah, I've seen her. Oh, my God, really? Please tell me everything you know. You help me first, and I'll help you. I'm very hungry. If you bring me some food, I'll tell you what I know. How about you tell me now, and I don't kick the shit out of you? Oh, I won't tell you anything if you hurt me, and if you kill me, you'll never find your daughter. Want to save her? Bring me the food. I'll wait here. I want food in exchange for information. I prefer I prefer canned food, but raw food will do will do in a pinch. See how generous I am? We need three raw food. Oh, fuck's sakes. I'm not going anywhere. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. That's annoying. That's really annoying. Okay, let's go over here. Maybe, maybe there's some food in the school. Look, there's a fridge here. Is there anything in this fridge? Is there magically three raw food in this fridge? <laughs> no. There's a bunch of wood and water in the fridge. <laughs> that was, uh, unique. The hell is that? Oh, is there some guy sleeping? I getcha. Yeah, let's grab that. Let's go over here and see what's over here. Med packs are large quantities, lots of dirty bandages. How could they have hoarded so many? Hey, stranger, don't touch our box. Have you recently been in the pharmacy? My daughter was there. Maybe you saw where she went. Where where we've been is none of your business. Now, fuck off. You don't understand. She's very ill. If I know, if you know something, you must tell me. You got hearing problems? I said, fuck off. You know what? What if I touch your goddamn box? Do you like me touching your box? Private property. You got a lot of stuff in the box, though. Fine, I won't touch your goddamn box. I'll leave. I'll leave, you bastard. I'll leave. I'll leave you, bastard. You have a lot of stuff there, though, and I would like all that stuff, but apparently this is a comfiest seat, but it has to do. All right, whatever. Grab all. We got some more medicine, which is fantastic. Let's go over here. I miss the old days. Oh, hey, guys. Have you seen a man with a 10-year-old girl? She's my daughter. Haven't seen any kids in a while, but I've been. I've seen some soldiers. Them bastards are worse than bandits. Bloody rapists and murderers. Pray it's not them that got our kid. She's very ill. They wouldn't hurt an ill child, would they? Oh, I don't know. That's the problem. Excuse me, ma'am. Looking for my daughter. Have you seen her? What? A child? Oh, my God. What happened? Do you know something? You must tell me. My own child was taken away from me. My poor boy. He was only seven. I'm sorry. I didn't know. But we can still save my daughter. No, he's gone. Why did you remind me of him? Why can't I just forget that happened? Leave me alone. Oh, my God. You've ruined her. You've ruined her, dude. Yeah, just couldn't leave her alone. And now she's ruined. Look at her. Look at her face. File of paper, we need to flee the city. Okay, this is something I've already read. I've already read. All right, let's go upstairs, because there was still an upstairs that I didn't even search yet. It's getting relatively late, and I know eventually I have to go back. It's already 3.10 a.m., and I think around 5 o'clock is my time limit that I can, I can, I have. So I have a guy who wants food, because he's a jackass, and I'm not surprised. Uh, what do I want to take here? I don't want the shell casings, because I don't really need that. I don't, I don't really have a gun. Quality roll up. These are good for trading. Um, I want the components. That's actually what I would I do want right now is components. Is there anything in here? No, I can't even enter because the door is barricaded. Let's get this out of the way. Look at the shovel. Glad I have this shovel. Look how fast that thing's going. Gotta leave this place fast. All right, I gotta go. I, I can't I can't stay here any longer. Unfortunately, um, the time is running out, and frankly, I can't I can't be here anymore. Um. So, the downfall- oh my god, it's literally 10 minutes left. Um, so the downfall is that I need to bring this guy food. I don't have food that I can bring this guy, and he's being a dick, and this is the only thing that I can- I can use. But the thing is, I can still go back to the gas station. Hopefully there's something there that I could utilize. Um, 
But let's see if also I can I can build the bridge now because I did get a lot. So that was calm. I'm thankful of that. I need to bring food to the school. Otherwise, the bum won't tell me where he saw Amelia. Even if he did see Amelia, to be honest with you. We don't even know if he did. Really? Oh my god. I need to build so much. Like, I need I need 25 components? Jesus Christ. Well, at least I got a decent amount of components. Now, if I have the barter guy come by again, maybe, maybe he has enough components that I can actually barter off of him to build that but I'm gonna leave this one here for the time being uh, we're, we're searching for Amelia obviously we are we're working towards uh, getting closer to her we got to bring some food we got to bring three raw food to that bum or the homeless person and hopefully he can tell us something about that if, uh, if even if he knows where she is but I'm gonna leave it here for the time being I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, the last of us storyline and uh, we will continue this in the next video and uh, we are on the search for Amelia so from I'm gonna leave it here guys make sure to leave a like to the video make sure to leave a comment below even sub to the channel always helps out uh, make sure to catch me on Sundays I do live stream on twitch TV forward slash heal please heal and uh, make sure to check out the link down below for my discord channel where you can catch me there and uh, join the healing nation <laughs> so for me to you guys make sure to heal please heal and I'll see you in the next video